Shout to DJ Fuse for that Woo! intro right yeah, there. Yeah, Let's yeah. go. That was hard. That was hard. Crazy, right? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you should hire him, bro. For <laughs> 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 whatever, <laughs> dog. Y'all want me to steal y'all DJ? <laughs> <laughs> he got to work both jobs. It's good. <laughs> <laughs> with me, I'll sign off on yeah, that. We Mexican, good. we do it about multiple jobs. <laughs> 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 we find a way to make it work. Well. <laughs> <laughs> he said we work multiple. You know, bro, we, us brown people, we work hard for it. I feel you. I feel you. We can do that, this. Some other shit. Come on. <laughs> oh, yeah. Build new side is coming. You need a new city built. You know the pyramids in Egypt, right? Everyone questions. We who did built it. Those. <laughs> the pyramids in Mexico, nobody questions. Who built those. <laughs> <laughs> we did that shit. Yeah. You feel me? For real. Yo, Roddy Rich, Rodolfo Rico, aquí está. Rodolfo Rico. Oh shit. Todo bien, hermano. Hey. Todo bien. <laughs> ¿Qué? ¿Qué? Alimentando las calles 13. You got to hit it with the K? Okay? Dale, dale, dale. What dale. day did you with it fast, too? You be saying something like, ¿qué? ¿Qué más leche? Stop so it. Feed the streets alimentando las calles 3. Huh? Say it one time. <laughs> alimentando. A, huh? Ali. Ali. Mentando. Alimentando. Las calles. Las calles. 3. 3. Disponible. Right. Huh? Disponible. I can't do it. I can't. <laughs> I'll try. It's out now. Go yeah, see, see, it's out now. It's out now. What I just said is out now. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, feed the street three out now. Roddy Rich, our guy, man. Always love the energy. Always appreciate the time, bro. Appreciate Seriously, y'all, man. man. And of course, the music. We just saw you on stage with Posty. That was crazy. Great yeah. show. Man. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Appreciate yes, it. Come on. Yep, you and Mustard out there on stage. That yeah, was dope. Love that's my the, dog. The, the Nipsey tribute. You yeah. also said that uh, Nip introduced you to Post. Yeah, so so uh, Robin Hood, Nip, um, they introduced us to Austin Rosen, who is close with, you feel me, Post and, um, and Dre London. And that's how the whole conversation started. That's yes, how we went on tour with him the first time. So, hey, hey, yeah, that's yeah. right, that's right. Yeah, yeah. It's a reoccurring thing, man. Yeah, it's family. Yeah, yeah, for sure. What's it like backstage? Are, are you really good at beer pong now? <laughs> I, I, I beat him. I beat him last game. Yeah, How yeah, much money on the yeah, line? yeah. We ain't, you know, po, you know, yeah, yeah, you know. <laughs> po, I ain't tripping. You know We're what I mean? Doing all that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It just, it's more me and him. Like he had us on the beer pong because you know when we went to Europe <clears throat> the mm-hmm. first time, we ain't, we ain't experienced. We just going to Europe type shit. So he had us doing that shit. So when we came back, it just, it felt like it was a full circle moment. That's like right. that we gonna yeah. keep. You know what I mean? Because I don't right. drink beer, but. But I drink it with post though. Oh, that's oh, right, okay. that's right. Did you also have a cigarette? <laughs> <laughs> nah, I mean you know, I'm all, you know, <laughs> you know. He be stressed for smoking. <laughs> he do for sure. He do. He do. Yeah, man. But he a good dude though. He yeah, good, he's a yeah. real really solid, good dude. Solid, solid yeah. guy. Very grateful guy. Did he give you a pair of Crocs? <laughs> nah, but he gave me a lot of money. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> for sure, gave me a lot of money. Fuck Crocs. <laughs> you, you know something that I, I noticed from him on stage was he was just very transparent. He was very like you know himself. Does right. that inspire you to just continue to be transparent? in a way with right. the fans with your audience and not take it too he, serious he told me how to just speak more and talk to them because they really here for you so you just have a conversation with your fans yeah. and talk to them and it may be things they don't know so just whenever you're thinking about your music and what it means to you and shit like that just you know help you learn when, that when you said son watch this man oh, yeah, that was yeah, dope yeah, bro yeah, yeah, man, yeah. What that was man. so dope yeah I just be thinking about if I was a kid and certain things like how would I want to remember or a certain shit? So, yeah, man. You know, my my son, man, he definitely inspiration to me. You know what I'm saying, and just keep me going. So, what's the Amazing. toughest part about being a dad? It's hard. The not knowing, mm-hmm. the not knowing. You know, just just being in it, and you could get all the advice, read all the books, whatever. But you know, you never just you never know. You know yeah. what I'm saying? So it just you just gotta keep. Keep God first in it, you know what I'm saying, and just always lean on Him for the understanding. But at the same time, it's just like, you know, you gotta just be there, yeah. really, be present. You gotta be present. Yeah. You ever spank them though? And learn them, huh? You ever spank them? I nah. I try not to. Uh, right yeah. Now, right? I, if he like when he was younger, I used to be like, damn, like grandpa, like little shit. But I, yeah, just a little. But I, I I I can't get into that. You know what I'm saying? Like that ain't really my. Yeah. Style. I'm sure. too like laid back for that shit. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, but when he 19, he might get in your face. <laughs> eh, nah. <laughs> nah. Positive nah. vibes, go by. Because it, it just not, not even them taller than you. I hear they look at nah. you a little different. With, with, with like my pops, you know what I'm saying? It's always just been like, we never. Like, we may, like, chop, like, nigga, nah, I feel like this, or, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I remember he had told me something about my son. Like, hey, Pops, like, this is my son. You know what I'm saying? Ooh. And we got off the phone, but then we talked back, and then he, like, 
you know, I respect you for that. You know what I'm saying? Because it's like anybody could come, and you got to do that. You know what I'm saying? I don't give a fuck if I'm your dad or whatever. So yeah. it's like it's just a constant learning thing with me and my pops, and I try to, you know, con- reconcile the relationship even with me and him and being he be in there. He be real, real involved with my son. You know what I'm saying? Isn't that great? And that's something that I can yeah. appreciate. What's he called? Shit. Papa? Pop? Hell, nah, nah, just Pop. Yeah, Grandpa. Like, I don't know. He's, he's Pop, I guess. I don't pop, know. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, Isn't like, it great having a dad? Yeah, he came around. <laughs> but, 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 you know, you're saying, you, you know. <laughs> I know my dad was always there, but was he? Yeah, he, he me? My, my, my pops, was, it was more on some shit like, he, like, I could call him. You know what I'm saying? Right, but like right. he was always working and him and my mom wasn't really together. So mm. he'd be doing his thing. Have a little chick and shit, you know what I'm saying, and shit like that. But yeah. He he was always. It wasn't like I ain't have no dad, but mm. it was more so just like I wish he was there more. I wish he came to games. I wish he yeah, certain things. Yeah. But we had those conversations, and it's cool. Like my dad never shunned me. It was just always like you know, like I'm here for you, but you in the world, you you, mm. you got to learn. You got to do certain things. So. It was you also take like care a of tough him. Love. Yeah, it was yeah. respect. You take care of him too. financially. My pops. Mm-hmm. Nah, that nigga rich. <laughs> Man. How so? My dad get money, man. What? I'm telling you. Really? Yes. Good for him, man. Yeah. I, don't know. I bought him a Porsche, but he told me don't buy him nothing else for the rest of my life. Wow. <laughs> yeah. That's how my pop is. I'm like that too, though. I don't like when people buy me shit. Man, my dad wants me to buy him everything, man. <laughs> <laughs> everything. At, at least yeah. you don't have to worry about expensive Christmas uh, yeah, gifts yeah. or anything. Pops just got rich, though. You know what I'm saying? Like, he was in school for a long time. Mm-hmm. What, did he get the lotto? <laughs> nah, nah, nah. Let me find out, darling. He was he, he was he was in school my whole life, and um, you know when I when I end up when I end up getting into the music and everything, he ended up graduating when I was like wow. 17, 18. Wow. So then you know he 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 do his work, but he, he that nigga rich Good man. Game, he man. Rich man. Yes, sir. The pops need to give me some money. <laughs> <laughs> he rich. Oh my I'm God. trying to tell you, he getting dope. <laughs> <laughs> I know, right? Like, yo, let's play Big Bang, Little Bang. Dad, let's yeah. see what's up. <laughs> nah, but but both my parents, I got to say I'm proud of them. They always say they're proud of me, but, like, both my parents, I'm proud of them because, you know, even, like, with all the success that I do, like, you know, my mom, she she actually took on a new trade. She did uh, hair my whole life, um, you know, 16-hour days, did hair a lot. And um, as we grew, you know, I got into the music. She like, you need to invest into uh, properties and stuff like that. So, boom, I started buying the houses, buying a little real estate. She took on construction, you know what I'm oh, saying? Wow. So now my mom is, like, building foundations and doing all type of shit like that, even along with buying the real estate. So now we, we kind of cornered in the construction and the real estate. Damn, Pop's doing this thing. So, Man, you know so you saying? better not it's walk in the house and say... Yeah, yeah. everybody just... You know, inspired to get it. You Everybody's know what I'm working, saying? Yeah. And yeah, that's yeah. the real net worth. Yeah, you know, that's yeah. that real, like yes, yeah. sir. So it's fine. It's but you can't ever say I'm tired around your parents. <laughs> I mean, I don't. You know yeah. what I'm saying? <laughs> they're gonna I don't. be like shit. <laughs> yeah, nah. My my mama, she really be asking me to take a break because like every time she called me, I'm either in the studio or I'm doing work. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? She so love you, man. yeah, she you know, but we working. So. Yeah, they always get on me for having two parents. <laughs> yeah, we say he's spoiled. Like, nah, 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 you got a dad and a mom? You spoiled. Two parent gang, you feel me? <laughs> I me feel you. you. My G. Yeah, no, nah, come on, we in it. So we in it. Connection. We in it. Nah, nah, nah. Don't get it. Nah, we ain't gonna go that far. I'm the Nah, I feel you. I feel you. I feel you. It's all love. Come on. Feed the Streets 3 out now, all streaming platforms. Run up the numbers. In the project, you say, I try not to fall in love. Why? Oh, man. Why not? What's, what's loving, loving, what's loving love? things too much? My, it's, it's sometimes it's, it's, it hurts. You know what I'm saying. Yeah. I feel like sometimes when you love something too much, you might put a little too much, um, yeah, put a little too much expectation on it. You know what I'm saying? So we don't like disappointment. I don't like being disappointed, and I definitely don't like to over exceed my expectations. So, do you love uh, bomb? What does that like mean? You do too much at first? Nah, definitely not. I'm complete opposite. Hmm. Know what I'm saying? You make them wait. I don't make them wait. I just kind of just see what's going on. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? That's how I like to play it. Just see what's going on. And a lot of times, you know, because I'm not a relationship type of nigga like, like that. Like, I count on 
couple of fingers how many girls I ever had in my life for real serious, you know what I'm saying? So it's like when it comes to that, I just it just always comes from a, a friendship type of thing, and then it just grow into, well, this is what I've experienced, you yeah, know what I'm saying? Yeah. It's like just grow into, okay, we're going to go out more, we're going to do more, we're going to be around each other more, and then eventually we kicking it all the time. We, you know, so now yes, that's my sir. girl, you know what I'm saying? That's how I use it. I got to be in a relationship. I love being in a relationship because that's like having two moms. <laughs> yeah, no, it's, it's a good thing. It's a good thing. You just can't force it. You know what I'm can't saying? That's it. That's, no. it. That's it. That's all. Man, having two moms is amazing. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> makes all my doctor's appointments. Make sure I eat well. Oh my I feel God. you. I feel you. What would you say is your toxic trait? Oh man, I'd be busy. 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 I'd be way too busy sometimes. You know, sometimes I never. I don't come home. Be busy. Out, don't answer calls. Yeah. But it's a grind too. Yeah. So. so that's probably like my. That's the worst. Like, but it'd be bad though. Like, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Stand in the studio till eleven in the morning. She's like, where was you at? You know what I'm saying? That shit is like. But that happens all the time. So that's probably the worst thing. Mm -hmm. Interesting. We're all toxic in our own way. Right. 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 I, I'm, I'm, I'm pretty sure some yeah. deeper. I'm pretty sure some deeper things, but. You know, that's probably the first thing that comes to my yes, head. Sir. You, you and I always think I'm right, so. <laughs> <laughs> you, you mentioned disappointment. Like, uh, what does that stem from, you think? Uh, is it trust issue? I just, I just, I don't like disappointment, you know? I just, I don't like to put too much faith in anything, you know what I'm saying? Because, mm -hmm. you know, I feel like even being on the other side of it, like, I know there's some people that are probably disappointed. So it's just like just knowing that, and that's just not a good feeling altogether. So I just don't like to be disappointed. I don't like to be let down. I mean, I, I don't really let myself get let down. If that makes sense. You know? For yeah. sure, for sure. Fade Away, who's that about? Fade Away. Hmm. It's <laughs> a good one. It's a good one. Yeah. It's a good He's one. gonna let the question fade away. Go yeah. <laughs> it's a good one. It's a good hey, one. Like, fade away. Away. That's, a, no, that's a good one. It's a good one. She's a good one. Yeah, yeah. Nah, she a good one. I, I, I feel like you know, it just it, it's it's yeah. It was a good vibe. Good vibe. Good vibe. Good vibe. Faded away. Yeah, yeah. Faded away. <laughs> Such a good vibe. It just. <laughs> <laughs> are, are we still anti-social? I feel like um, you claim it in the in, in the project. Yeah, I mean, you know, we 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 we, we y'all see me grow. You know what I'm saying? We've been here. I done been in the room probably just real condensed personality before. I feel like when I'm comfortable in the spaces and comfortable with the people, I'm gonna be cool. I'm gonna chill. But I'm still, if I just met someone or I'm still, you know what I'm saying, trying to get to know them, I'm still a little like standoff. Sure, still, yeah. yeah. You observe. Yeah. Way more than conversation. Yeah. Yeah. That's like some chosen one shit. You feel me? Like you mm. sit back and, and lighten. You you invite you and you know, you invite the spirits that you connect with. Right. I I feel like that's why we got two ears and one mouth. You know what I'm saying? It's like let's let's be in two eyes. You know what I'm saying? We visual, we wanna hear it, you know what I'm saying? Figure out where we at, two hand. Yeah. One mouth. Keep it closed and once you feel like you gotta Say something. Go ahead. I'm saying. Yeah. Mm. Ah, shit. I usually talk before I speak. <laughs> talk before you speak. I mean, I think. You speak. Prime example. Exactly. How this is working. <laughs> <laughs> Filming just all chweck. Oh, oh my God. God. <laughs> yeah. Body Rich is here. Feed the streets. Three. Hello. My guy. You also say that uh, if uh, we want to know how much you're worth, to look it up. So we did. You're worth 20 million. True or false? You know. It, it went. It probably. I'm. I, I, you know what? He's gonna let it I'm away. priceless. How about that? I'm priceless. priceless. Respect, there we go. respect that. Respect that. Nah. Respect the internet it. says I'm worth two million, and that's a lie. <laughs> <laughs> that's the biggest lie on, on the internet. Come on, come right on. <laughs> the world's biggest lie. That is, I don't know when that'll ever be true. Yeah, nah, nah, but it's, it's up good. There, my G. Yeah, no, nah, I'm trying to build though. You know, we've been uh, just trying to trying to stay in, involved in the community. We got property in the community. We've been, we've been trying to. I'm trying to open up a studio right now too. Hey. Uh, working on that. So just kids? expanding, huh? Mm -hmm. Is that for kids? Uh, or just you know, for, I, I, for I feel like it's gonna be for us right now. Um, having future plans of doing different things involving the kids and shit like that. We yeah. uh, we we been in Darby Park a lot too in Inglewood, Darby Park. We've been um doing AAU with uh the City Stars, you know what I'm saying. So that's that's one of my 
little vices. I used to love to play basketball. I never made it to the league. Mm. You know what I'm saying? So Was it a height issue? Um, I think it was just I ain't love it enough. I mm. ain't care. I feel like I could I could have made it anywhere. If I wanted to be whoever I wanted to be, I could have made it wherever. I know that the height shit is crazy, but I, I feel like I probably could have went overseas or something. Oh, if I tried yeah, I ain't yeah. tried And if you really like Yeah if I really way. loved it Cause like music I don't think I was that good In the beginning You know what I'm saying I don't think I was that good But it's just the trying part The hard work part Yes sir Pay Yes off. sir What's up Jack uh, You also mentioned Kim you better get back with Ye Why <laughs> oh, do you want yeah. that to happen I want that to happen too uh, I'll be honest I don't want it to happen Cause I we just, have a bet going on Yeah I just feel like I'm, I'm pushing togetherness You know what I'm saying yes, Just sir. in general In the world We live in today feel like we just want to push togetherness you know what i'm saying we want to push like just just staying together and being one and being whole you know what i'm saying at the end of the day that's how i look at it you know it ain't too many political things that you know what i mean it's just more so just everybody i just want everybody to get along and you know the metaphor saying? that's 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 where i'm kind of at with it just yeah togetherness peace my g right yeah. peace yeah so who's fade away about <laughs> Here we go again. Look, I tried, guys. I tried. It's all right. Yes. Nah, nah. It's togetherness. It's, you know, togetherness. You, yeah, yeah. Togetherness. You know yeah, what I'm man. saying? Yeah. You always, you always got to set those vibes, and you know. Yeah, man. Snoop on the project. Yeah. Feed the streets three. Big homie. I've been talking to Snoop so much, man. Yeah. Yeah. Life advice. He just been like he just been just, just big homie talk. putting a battery in my back. Like not not in a bad way though. Just like yeah. you need like Roddy like. Start doing that. Start doing this. Look into this. Look into that. Like, you feel me? Just on that. Like, so I appreciate Snoop. You know what I'm saying? He one of them ones that's like in the in the older generation that really embraced me, but like on some heavy shit. You know what I'm saying? On some real heavy shit, but just behind the scenes type shit. Early, right? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, for sure early, but mm -hmm. just now that he know w the potential of what I can do, mm -hmm. it's like now that the conversation is expanding. You get what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Like, okay, let's let's see about this or that. You know what I'm saying? Even little plays. That we looking into, he like, all right, I want to be a part of that. I want to see you do, you know what I'm saying? So it's just, it just I, I really appreciate him for that, you know what I'm saying? Because it ain't a lot that's yeah, in that age bracket that's going to really put their put they arm around you. Yeah. Like that. Snoop is, I believe, <clears throat> the most famous rapper alive. I think he's one of the most famous people. We argue about this shit all the time. <laughs> right? I think he's one of the most famous people in the world. Oh, absolutely. I think so. Yep. He can go anywhere. You can go to India and they know I, who Snoop is. I mean, it's the queen, then it's Snoop. Yeah. Queen. That's how I look at it. Like, oh, for queen. real, nah, cause cause the Snoop queen ain't even here no more, so it's just yeah. RIP. <laughs> RIP. <laughs> but 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 yeah, yeah, oh nah. Gosh, Snoop, 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 bro, you smoking weed. The first person you think about is Snoop. Yeah. The second person you think about is Wiz, but yeah. Snoop. You feel me? Like, Does he really smoke 150 joints a day? No, he, he debunked that. He said it was false. He said it was false. Snoop? Yeah. He smoke a lot. He smoke, he a, smoke lot. a lot. Garcia yeah. used to work with him. They did a radio show together back in the day. Yeah, he smoked uh, a lot. It was just constant smoking. I mean, right? Yeah, man. I mean, and you talk about loyalty and stuff. You're right. Once he fucks with you, he fucks with you. Yeah. He will give you advice on whatever you want because he feels like he's investing mm -hmm. in you. Right, right, that's right. That's the dude. He's never changed in 30 years. Yeah, known yeah. He's never changed. And that's why he is where he is. Exactly. A lot of people came out the same time as him. Where are they? Right. He's He's figured out a way to parlay everything. Right, right, everything. right. You know, when when you figure out yes, I, uh, that there's enough pie for everybody and there's no like selfishness and mm -hmm. you move with togetherness in mind, mm -hmm. longevity is it's at the end of that equation. Right, 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 right. So right. You definitely figure that out. He also got inducted to uh, nominated for the Songwriter Hall of Fame recently. Mm. I don't know if you. I didn't know, know that. that I didn't know that. Yeah. I'm like, yo, that's sick, dog. I mean, like, he deserved it. Absolutely, yeah. he deserved that. He deserved that. Yeah, and then some. Exactly. I love when he thanked himself at the, the Hollywood Walk of Fame. <laughs> that was player. Yeah. That inspired so Gangsta. many. You feel me? For real. He's like, yo, I got to thank myself for never taking a day off or working hard. I want to thank myself, my G. Yeah. That is really you have to. Though. You know, yeah. it's, that's, that's self care. You got to give Snoop his flowers, man. You got to. Mm -hmm. for Who sure. else deserves flowers? Hmm. You know what? I want to take the time out to give Kiefer his flowers. Y'all may not know who Kiefer is. Go ahead. Kiefer is, um, he been producing with me from the beginning. All these albums we ever put out together. Mm -hmm. Think about somebody who, you know, never ever asked me for anything, but put in the same, if not more, amount of time into every music, every song you ever heard from me. He put in the same amount of time as me. There's not a producer that pull up or an A&R that pull up every two weeks or every other day or whatever. It's like every time I'm at the studio, 
he's at the studio. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Every time I'm out of town, he's out of town. Wherever I'm at, he's there. You know what I'm saying? So I got to, I, like, this is one of my brothers, like, I got to give him his flowers while he, you know what I'm saying, can smell him. Like, I appreciate him to nigga the moon and back. Anything I ever been through, my darkest times, you know, my, my, my worst secrets, everything. And it's like somebody that people see and they may think, oh, this is just your friend. Like, nah, like, I would die for that you know what I'm saying? Like wow. that's like really my brother. So I gotta give him his flowers. Fuck the famous shit, the the rap shit cool, but that's one person in my life that I appreciate I ever met that that nigga. You know what I'm saying? That man. That's great. For sure. wow, I appreciate that's amazing. that. Man. Yeah. That's cool, man. Does he mm-hmm. know how you feel about him like that? Yeah. yeah. That's great, man. It's my boy. He he I mean, you know, we always celebrate together. We do everything, you know what I'm saying? But you asked me, so I that yes, was that sir. was like, you know what I'm saying? No, like, take the time, sure. yeah, for yeah. real, man. Uh, Westbrook, let's give him his flowers as well. Oh uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, nah. but I always, I always make sure, I always make sure he, cause they be on him too tough. No, they yeah, be on him way too tough. I remember we asked you about him at the BET joint. You were like, yo, he one of them ones. Yeah, yeah, he, they be on him too tough. <laughs> yeah, he basically shut the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> they be on him too tough. And he Come posted on. a video. I, I was like, he what? Did. He yeah, did. That's, he my that. yeah, that's my boy. That's my boy. That's my boy. Cause he one of them ones. Man. He's one of them what ones, does that bro. mean? He's one of them ones. <laughs> He just. Oh, yep. Shit. All right. <laughs> right. 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 Yeah. Yeah. I mean. <laughs> nah. Um. I just like his character, bro. I like his character, bro. I like. I like yeah. that he work hard on the on the basketball side, but his family. You know what I'm saying? He take care of his family. I know his brother will real well. He know. He know. It's crazy because he with one of the people that grew up with me, like one of the ladies grew up with me and stuff like that, and I just know their family. Little, little cool yeah. so so yeah I feel like just his character and who he is and how he stand on business like even though they talking crazy even though they might go against him he's still standing on business for what he he's what he on that so, hill for sure so it's good you feel yeah, me yes, like sir, he man. one of them ones mm-hmm. he coming off the bench showing everybody how it's done yeah that. nah come on he, you know, he, he, he he adopted that role he's carrying the team he good crazy huh it's crazy that's that crazy complete 180 complete. he good he, he a good one <laughs> to me he one of them mm-hmm. ones yeah one of them ones my G <laughs> I remember I uh, I was at a at a at a release something and he was there and I was gonna go up to that for like hey fool you know that interview you, you, you hey, reposted <laughs> that was on our show dog no? yeah. <laughs> but he was with his you know he was he was busy and I didn't want to approach because like you don't you know you never want to get into somebody's yeah, private yeah, yeah. space but that being said though how do you like being approached or how does one approach someone of your status like without being doing too much or without you know I feel like just pers- getting tackled by security yeah yeah yeah, yeah nah, person to person is just about respect you know what I'm saying if you pull up and it's all respect like we're gonna respect you that's it you know what I'm saying like and even if I got fans surrounding me like and you disrespecting other fans we're not gonna go for that either you know what I'm saying mm. like we ain't going for that you know what I mean like that's 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 really the vibe we give like if you give him respect we ain't tripping we gonna stop for you we gonna do whatever you know what I'm saying it done been times shit I, I, I done stopped and did crazy shit for people just on some random shit but you know mm-hmm. media don't know about it but just you know we stop and we and we care about the world it ain't just like oh nigga he on this like we'll help a granny walk across the street if she need help you know what I'm saying that's what My we dog. on yep. so that's it's right. cool just do the human thing. Yeah, it's like human the shit. Great thing. Yeah. For sure. Mm-hmm. Uh, you were raised right, man. Two parents. <laughs> <laughs> you were raised right, my nah, for real. <laughs> my mom. I thought if you only had one parent, you weren't raised right. <laughs> yeah, dog, what I you mean, dog? I was just saying, <laughs> your moms. parents took their I got my mom on the yeah. phone right now. <laughs> yeah. Your Come mom on. is great, man. I love your moms, man, for real. Mm, yeah. Yo, Feed the Streets 3, out now, all streaming platforms. Where do you keep the Grammy? At the crib? Is it put away or do you put it Yeah, I tuck it up. I tuck it up. I took it up. Where it's is it? on display? Nah. No. I had it on the table for a second, but I keep it tucked up. I keep all my, my memorabilia. I don't never hang my plaques up and then. Are they not real really? to you, or is it just kind of like, ah, I'm not done working, so why why celebrate? I just don't. I just, you know, it's cool. It's I cool. Just, I, just, I just put it up, you know what I'm saying? Okay. When, I, when, I, um, when I need to re- revisit it, you know, I do that, but I just keep it tucked. You know, that them is like them is more valuable than a lot of things I have, so I just put it away. Mm. Yeah. Well, I'm gonna say if you don't want it, I'll take it. Yeah, I'm just saying, nah. if you ever run out of walls, yeah, no, nah, it, it ain't it right right one. It's just it, <laughs> those are real, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna look back years from now yes, and sir. maybe put it, you know what I mean? But nah, right man, now just I just flex and put it in your kids' room. 
I feel that too. Yeah, yeah. I feel that like, too. Like, son, watch this. <laughs> <laughs> you feel me? You gotta yeah. instill that in yeah, the yeah, battery no, sure, early, sure, man. Sure, yeah, sure, right sure. there next to the Captain sure. America joint. You feel yeah, me? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What cartoons are you watching? He be he be stuck on the Mickey Mouse, bro. He be stuck on the Mickey Mouse. Yeah. You got a Disneyland so pass yet or not? The Magic yeah. Key. What are they calling it? I took him to um, price too. I took him to Orlando a couple of months ago. Oh, it was cool. To Orlando. Yeah. Get out the city. You know there what I'm saying, Sean? Private jet. Of course. <laughs> My son ain't never flew commercial. Really? Wow. Ever. Whoa. Are, you think you're ruining that experience for him when he gets older? <laughs> What's the experience? Nah, he's going to be cool. But, you know, in the beginning, you got to think in the beginning of his, when he came in, yeah. it was it was COVID. So that's how that started. And then after it was crazy, you know. Everything tell yeah. your son, I said, hi, pal. <laughs> 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 tell me that ain't good. <laughs> so, oh, boy. <laughs> we gonna say feed the streets three. <laughs> feed the streets three. Told <laughs> <laughs> you we could do it all. Real nice man, and the Mickey Mouse boys. Oh yes, gosh. sir. Man. Appreciate you, brother. Thank come on, you, man. Come on. Yo, check out more of our YouTube interviews now. ASAP Plus. Download the free iHeartRadio app so you can check out the Crew Show podcast.